Oh, hey guys. This is the uh, 2019 Mazda MX-5 Club Sport. Or, if you will, a 2019 Mazda Miata Club Sport. Whatever you call it, it's fantastic fun. So let's go ahead and take a look. This is the 2019 Mazda MX-5 Club Sport. It's driving joy personified in a simple, accessible package. But honestly, what does that mean? It means that there's a tactile and direct connection between you and the car without modern day buffers. Let me explain. Modern day cars nowadays are insulated with multiple layers of electronics, and that electronic buffer removes some of the tax out sensations that come with driving. It removes the feel. The feel is what makes a Miata, well, a Miata. The feeling of being one with a machine and almost an organic connection with it in the road is what makes a Miata really special. On the mechanical front, the MX-5 is as simple as you can get. Front engine, rear wheel drive, and with our tester's glorious manual transmission, it makes it an absolute joy. There's no force induction, there's no electric boost, there's nothing in the way between you and the car. And before I go into the actual numbers, here's a little warning. In a world of 300 horsepower Toyota Camrys and 800 horsepower Dodges, these numbers are well cute in comparison. But as I said before, numbers mean nothing. So powering this is a 181 horsepower, 2 liter 4 cylinder. The engine was overhauled last year to provide some much needed power, but more importantly, much needed soul. The 2.0 now comes alive in the upper rev band and sounds utterly fantastic. From there, it's bolted to one of the finest manuals available today and sending power to the rear wheels with a LSD. The interior of the MX-5 is where this really shines. The most common competitor is the GT86, and honestly the 86 has a craptastic interior. It's plasticky, it's cheap feeling, and has a head unit from Hi-Fi Buys back in 1999. The MX-5 in contrast has a superb interior. Most everything is covered in soft touch materials. The Recaro seats hold you nice and tight and the color coordinated accents on top of the door really help set off an interior that makes it an occasion to step in and not a chore. <laughs> The only fault I can give is the infotainment rig. It's slow, not rendered well, and overall just feels like an afterthought. Thankfully, it does have CarPlay integration as a saving grace. On the exterior, our club model comes with a beautiful set of 17-inch BBS forged wheels, and as you can see peeking behind, a set of gorgeous Brembo brakes. Now to round out my thoughts, this is an easy one. MX-5 is a car that no person can tell you about. It's a car you need to experience. So do me a favor, go to your nearest Mazda dealer and just drive one. Because there's two types of people in the world, those who've driven a Miata and understand it, and those who haven't and question why. That why always gets answered immediately in the first 25 feet in your first drive. So thanks for watching, this is Yusuf signing off till next time.